Hey guys, this is Radar Mario 21 back here for more. Let's play Pokemon Blue. So here we are on Route 16, and here we have Snorlax. So let's wake him up. And since it's Generation 1, have to go through the menu because it sucks. So here we go. Let's use it. You'll take my life, but I'll take yours too. You fire your musket, but I'll run you through. So when you're waiting for the next attack. Uh oh, he's awake. Here we go. The big Snorlax fight. Yes, I finally have the balls to take on Snorlax. And no, I'm not talking about Master Balls. I'm just talking about Ultra Balls. Uh, found out they sell Ultra Balls in Fuchsia City, so I bought a couple, bought like 10 of them, I think. So yeah, it's just got like 10 Ultra Balls, and this a-hole's going to sleep. You suck. Let me just, I'll try Slash. Maybe I won't kill it. Hopefully I don't kill it. Awesome! And he's still asleep. So, like I said, I have Ultra Ball, so... Ball away. By the way, this is take two. I got a uh, blooper reel of take one. It's actually pretty funny. At least I hope you think it is. And there it is! Snorlax was caught. Blah, blah, blah. New data. It, all it does is sleep and eat. And special story with Snorlax. It's nickname... Zyvera87. I can't put the 87 in there, so it's just Zyvera, but whatever. Anyway, I'm naming my, Zor my Snorlax after him, because he told me he always wants to go to a video game convention like a PAX or something, cosplay as Snorlax, and fall asleep in the hallway. Yeah. So for that, Snorlax will be named Zyvera, and he'll rot in my PC forever, so sucks for him, but whatever. See you guys back at C4 Mile, and I'll be back. Hold on. All right, I'm back and I'm on Seafoam Island, so yeah, here we go. Here, you can't go to the cave on the right because that's the exit, actually. I can go to the cave on the left and I see a random trainer, so let's fight him or her. Why the hell not? Ah, uh, do I want to start with Hetfield? Probably not. I think I'll start with Cliff. Why? Well, uh, yeah, because Cliff is the lowest leveled. Be on the safe side. Start with Cliff Burton. How about sleeping with the fishes? You like sleeping with the fishes? Cause I'll make you sleep with the fishes, bitch. Oh, beauty, okay. What do you got? Seeking? Well, uh, I got Cliff Burton, who's a water type. Might not be a good matchup, but look at this move set. Hell yeah. Thunderbolt, die. This is why I spammed all those eight all those TMs with missing no. And you just suck. You suck at life, madam. Die. I don't care how effective it is. It killed you. You're sleeping with the fishes now, beauty. Youch. I didn't even... I ain't even hurt you. Your Pokemon got hurt. Not you. Uh, okay. Yo, know, screw this adventure. I'll just float with you all day. You look kind of hot, I guess. But no. I gotta leave her. We gotta go in. We must go forth and dominate. And new Pokemon, actually. Slowpoke. Awesome. I was actually... Actually, I think these are relatively rare in Pokemon Blue. They're more common in red than they are in blue. And I'm going to try surfing on it. See how much damage I do to it. Hopefully not too much. Hopefully a decent amount. Okay, I'll do it. That works. I can work with that. Ultra Ball, I found that I have like a bunch of them now. I got 18 of those freaking things. So yeah. And hell yeah, Slowpoke was caught. Alright, new Pokedex data. The dopey Pokemon, blah blah blah. I'm not going to call it retarded because that's kind of offensive. But uh, I'm going to name it as an insult. I'm actually going to get rid of it after I evolve it, so yeah. Slowpoke, your name is Lick Me. If you guys know what Slowpoke's evolution is traded for, it's actually pretty funny because the, the thing you traded for actually kind of sucks. So I'm going to tell that guy just to lick me because that's the only way I can get that st certain Pokemon. And Gobat, the evolved form of uh, Zubat. That's what I'm looking for. Yeah, Gobat. Poison flying, and I'm going to try and catch him so I don't have to 
level up that stupid level 7 Zubat I got in Mount Moon. And will it work? Hell yeah! Don't you be screeching at me! Don't you be screeching at Cliff Burton! Cliff Burton don't go for the screechy girl type. Anyway, Ultra Wall, go! Are you kidding me? Really? You're a Golbat! That's an Ultra Ball, you are in red HP! You are not a legendary, you need to be caught right now! Oh, for God's sake! Get in my ball! You got one more shot, then I'm just gonna skate through it and use a Master Ball. Thank you! Good God! You're not that rare, you're not that hard to catch! And, you know what, I was thinking about naming you something halfway cool, but no! You're getting the same crappy nickname Zubat got! You also are known as Hepatitis Z. Even though your name doesn't start with a Z anymore, I don't care. If I can remember how to spell Hepatitis, so off the top of my head, there we go. Go to my PC and be banished forevermore. You suck. I had to come back here because, yep, Boulder got to push down the hole. New Pokemon? Yeah, actually, Krabby, uh... Nah, it's a uh, below average water type. Not a big fan of it, but again, completing the Pokedex. So, let me just catch it. Once again, another episode of catching a whole bunch of Pokemon that I'm never going to use. Wow, you suck! Good God, that was bad. Anyway, uh, Slash, Strength, move that boulder, man. Just move that boulder. And I should probably fall in with it. I think that's a strategy. Yeah, I think this is the best way to do it. And Gen 1 rules. Gotta go back to the menu. I honestly love Gen 1. It was like one of the greatest... You think? Anyway, as I was saying, you know, Gen 1 was probably one of the greatest... Gen Generation 1 of Pokemon was probably one of the most original and cutting-edge games to ever come out for the original Game Boy. And here we go, Krabby Part 2. So, I'm going to use Ice Beam Moment. Hopefully it won't die. Anyway, so yeah. with all, It does have a lot of flaws, but remember, this game came out in 1998. Oh my god. You are a worthless piece of crap, Krabby. Anyway, this came out in 1998. Alongside games like Mario Land and Kirby's Dream Land that were also great games, but extremely limited in their terms of gameplay. So this is actually a pretty big game for such a small little system. You gotta admit it. I mean, obviously it's got nothing on the 3DS, but that's like comparing the regular Nintendo to a freaking GameCube or something. You just can't do it. And, of course, you know, screw you, Colbat! I got another Ultra Ball for free. Up yours. All right, Cliff, let's go. We gotta make our way through this current. The current of doom! I really don't know, but whatever. Uh, what, what to do now? I think this is the right way to go. Yeah, I th nope, dead end. I think that sign just says something stupid like the current is fast and you can't surf. Because I'm a freaking moron and I can't tell by the waves myself. But whatever. Hey, new Pokemon, Psyduck. What, pure water type? Not really anything to write home about stat-wise, so hopefully I won't kill it. Please don't kill it, Cliff. Thank you! And you miss on a scratch! God, you suck! What is with these Pokemon? They're just terrible. Hopefully I can catch it in an Ultra Ball. Really? Three shakes! Three freaking shakes! My God! You're just trolling me, game. You know I have all these Master Balls that are... I want to be fair. You know, I want to be fair and catch you guys legit. I don't want to use all my Master Balls just because I have them, but you're going to push me to a game. And yeah, we all know about Psyduck from the anime, blah, blah, blah. It's na it is named at going to be named after ancient Pokemon from South Park. Come on, Kenny. Give me Penguin. Give me Penguin, Kenny. Except Penguin will be in the PC to rot, t rot till it's death, I guess. Sorry, Penguin. But, them some breaks, buddy. 
And, oh my god, yet another, I'm getting all these new Pokemon, just bam, 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 this is awesome. Seal, it actually has uh, pretty good defenses, I think, especially when it evolves, becomes a water ice type. But not a bad Pokemon, it's probably the second best water ice type, but, in my opinion, but... Oh, there are like four or five water types I like better than it, so once again, it's just a victim of being a common type. Okay, you're down in the yellow. I'm, I've weakened you. You're growling at me despite the fact I'm a special attacker. Ultra Ball, go. Please catch. Thank you. And yes, I'm going to give it, give it a name. It's got a big hard horn, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to name the condom. Yeah, you got to protect that big hard horn, man. Always protect your big hard horn. That's the Radar Mario, Lesson of Life. Hope you guys enjoyed it. But the episode's not over yet, in case you thought it was. I don't know why, but... Anyway, Slat, we're gonna... Move some more boulders, because that's what we gotta do. That's what Slash has to do. Slash, just think of picking up these rocks and throwing them at Axel's head, because I know you want to do that. Then I want to leave that boulder there, because I don't want to trap myself. Hell yeah, I won't. Kick ass. Really? <laughs> nice. Yeah, Seafoam Island's also where you can find Star You if you don't want to fish for it, but if you fish for it, you get it at level 15, you have a better opportunity to raise it, and the lower the level you catch your Pokemon originally, the better stats it'll have once you raise it, so. I just recommend catching Staryu at level 15 if you want to use one. That's just my own personal opinion. It's kind of a waste of time to catch one at 31. You know, it'll level up a lot quicker, catch up to your team a lot quicker, but it won't be as strong in the long run. And trust me, Starmie is a beast. It is one of my best Pokemon in Pokemon Stadium. And speaking of wit strong Pokemon, what can we have here? What is this? Another bird? Articuno, the ice flying legendary bird. Like Zapdos, I'm just going to cheap out and throw a Master Ball at it because I have no desire to go through the whole process. Especially with the luck I've been having with no regular Pokemon like freaking Psyduck and Golbat. They won't catch. Screw it. I'm not even going to try. Articuno, get in the ball, go to my PC. I never want to hear from you again. Ice to see you, Mr. Freeze. But no, I'm not naming it lame, something lame like Mr. Freeze. It's a cool Pokemon, so it gets a cool nickname. Articuno's nickname will be named after the great pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays in... Not... Oh, there we go. The great pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays in Philadelphia Phillies. This guy's name, Roy Halladay. Because he's... Roy Halladay is just a great pitcher, or was a great pitcher back in the day, so yeah. Articuno, he can... Halladay can freeze you, and so can Articuno. Anyway, let's just get back on Cliff and let's get the hell out of this godforsaken dungeon. That sounds cool, doesn't it? I guess it does. Am I going the right way? Nope. Alright, is there anything this way? Alright, Krabby, this is your third chance. I'm going to hit you with an ice beam and I don't want you to die. I don't want you to be super weak. You are supposed to resist this. Please do not suck. Thank you for not sucking. Thank you so much for not sucking. Seriously, my god. Your two brothers, my... They're resistant against it. And they still died. Since Krabby is such a pathetic Pokemon, you will be named after a pathetic character from Futurama. You can probably figure out who I'm naming it after. Pathetic, Crab, who do you think? It's Zoidberg, of course. Zoidberg, enjoy the PC. It's probably a hell of a lot nicer than that dumpster you've been living in. Is this the right way to go? Uh, maybe. I'm not sure. Okay, let's see if this... No, not, not the right way to go yet. Crap. I got in a couple of random fights for no reason, but whatever. Gotta go back the other way and get that other boulder. 
Like I was say, oh my god! I'm gonna have to start throwing up some repels now. Actually, yeah, yeah, let me throw up a repel like right now. Super repel, go. Thank god I won't be annoyed by crappy Pokemon anymore, for a while at least. We'll be safe, for a time. It's like at the end of Ocarina of Time when Zelda says that. It's like, gee Zelda, thanks for the optimism. Is this the right way to go? Not quite, crap. Where do I go? Where do I go? This is where I always get lost in good old Seafoam Island. So much fun getting lost in Seafoam. Is this the right way? This is where I just freaking was! Great! Uh, where am I supposed to go now? Maybe this way. Please tell me this is the right way to go. Okay, I see a hole, I see a hole, I see a rock! Woohoo! Here we go! Hopefully this will work. Alright, same stuff. Follow, follow the boulder. Don't follow the buzzers, but follow the boulder. And make sure on every floor you gotta reuse strength. Because that's how this... Thank you! I would have never guessed. A boulder that's twice the size of me requires strength to move because it's heavy? I would have never guessed that in a million years, game. Never. And thanks for asking if I wanted to use strength or not. And, yep, here we are. About to get out, get the hell out of here, so... And Repel's effect wore off. Crap. Two steps without Repel and I get bombarded, of course. Hello! Level 39 Kingler. Awesome. I'll try and catch it. Yeah, let's give it a shot. I'll actually move, use a move that's of neutral damage and try and catch you. Please don't kill me. Thank you. Ultra Ball, go. Come on! You curb stomping me now? You suck. Get in my ball. You suck. Now you're leering at me. Again, one more try at the Ultra Ball, then I'm just going straight to a Master Ball. I don't care. You suck. I have to waste a Master Ball on you? My god. It is all just because I'm too lazy to pump that other Krabby full of rare candies just to make it evolve, so... Hope you're proud of yourself, Kingler. And once again, you will be named Zoidberg. So I'm just going to cut that out. Alright, now, hopefully I can make it out of here without getting annoyed. Please let me get out of here without getting annoyed. Will it work? Hell yeah! There we go. So we made it out of Seafoam Island, and I'll call it an episode. So until next time, this is Radar Mario 21. See you then. Bye. Not confident in my great balls to capture this dude. Yeah, I know my balls are great, but I'm not confident in them. Ha ha ha. Anyway, yeah, just waiting for the Ultra Balls. That's about it. That's the only thing. And yeah, use Amnesia. Good, because that's gonna do. That's gonna make Ember do less damage. I'm glad. I don't want to keep- ARE YOU KIDDING ME?!